As any mother would tell you, there is no manual for motherhood. So our next guest has actually written a book that will take some of the guesswork out. Francis Fernandez has authored the book Fish in the Dryer, Smart Advice for Moms of Boys. She's got four boys and one daughter, ranging in age from 5 to 18. Francis, welcome to daytime. You Thank finally you so got much. your daughter, right? <laughs> yes, after, <laughs> after four boys. Now, I'm guessing, and I'm sure this is a good guess, by the name of the book Fish in the Dryer, Smart Advice for Moms of Boys, you had at one point a fish in your dryer. Tell I us sure that story. I did. I did. Um, my boys went fishing with their dad it's something that they do and they enjoy very much with their father and so it was a typical day they all went fishing got their snacks got on the boat and they were gone and I stayed home with you know the baby at the time and they came home and I was you know preparing they brought fish and you know there we were gonna have dinner and I said everybody go take a shower put everything where it needs to be and they threw everything in the laundry the way they <laughs> normally would and so that evening I'm going to bed and I'm like, oh wait, I have to throw everything in the dryer. And I grab the clothes, I throw it in the dryer, I don't check or nothing, I just, you know, throw everything in the dryer. The next morning I wake up and I open the door to the dryer and there's this fish on the door of the dryer. Oh, no. And I scream so loud, I bet my neighbors heard me and I was just like, who left fish? And I wasn't worried about the fish, I was worried about having to do that load again. Yeah. That's what I was worried about. It was probably poached lovely oh, though because yes. it was so warm in the but dryer. But the fish was intact. Oh, I wow. took a picture of Fully it. Fully cooked. Yeah, I took a picture of it and I started to send it to some family members because I was like, you guys will not believe <laughs> and I always told my boys since they were very young one day I'm gonna write a book because there has to be a mom out there that knows that she's not alone I'm not the only one surviving these stories with you guys and they would joke around and they would say yeah sure mom one day one day so that's why when I titled mm. the book I said I'm definitely sharing that story Good for you. because this is one of so many that I have enjoyed well, with there's, them. there's lots of advice in the book and and one of the scenarios is what what do you do when you when a stranger or somebody just comes up to you and says your boys have been acting up or their teacher says that well how do you what do you do about that well the first thing I do is where's this advice coming from or where's that comment coming from right. at that young age of 23 with my first one I didn't know you know I just took whatever anybody would say to me but then I learned first I need to acknowledge who is this person that's saying this mm -hmm. does this person have a son first mm -hmm. of all right. do they know what this is like to have a son it's not the same thing when you're raising a daughter as when you're raising a son so then I started to realize if they don't have a son they really don't know what I'm living they have no idea what is the difference the rambunctiousness of the boys that absolutely just, just they have so much energy and they want to be playing and they want and so if you don't know how to channel that positively you know let him play let him build a fort let him he's a man this is a man you're raising and you know they love to be adventurous and you know my teenager came home about a week ago and he went hunting with his father and he came home with two rabbits in his hand. <laughs> any mom Hunter would have been gatherer. like, any mom would have said, no, take that out of the house. Or, and I was like, wow, that's so cool. You know, like they want you to be participant of what it is that their next adventure is. Right. And so that's really how I took it up. You know, now is I see, do you have a son? Are you, you know, do you have that advice to give me? Right. I and know there's not, a lot, then, a lot in the book, but give us one takeaway for moms of boys out there that might be sitting there going, oh my gosh, okay, what, what have I got myself into? You know, it's, it's about the adventure that they're living. Mm -hmm. And be as involved and as connected as you can because the truth is you're raising the next generation of men. Mm -hmm. And that boy is going to be someone's husband and yeah. someone's father. Right. And you need to make sure that when that wife or girlfriend or child comes back to you, they say, thank you for doing a good job. Right. All yeah. right. You Being know, respectful. that's the best thing yeah. that I can advise any mom who has a son. They're full of adventure. They sure are. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Lots of stuff in the book. It's called Fish in the Dryer, Smart Advice from Moms of Boys. Francis Fernandez, thanks so much. Thank Appreciate you. It. We'll be thank right back so with much. more daytime right up to this. Stay with us.